Students at this Lawrence Yeshiva glued to televisions watching Senate confirmation hearings of a man they consider a hometown hero. It's very inspiring to both myself and to uh, all the students here, as well as the community at large. Uh, it shows that um, if you, you really can make a difference. Support here brimming over for David Friedman. He's fantastic. He's very smart, very passionate about Israel, which means he wants peace because anyone that loves Israel and loves America wants peace. Friedman, a bankruptcy attorney who lives in Woodsburg, grew up in North Woodmere, where his father was a prominent rabbi. Now a member of this Orthodox temple in Cedarhurst, he speaks fluent Hebrew. Fellow Five Towner, attorney Ben Brofman, calls his longtime friend an exceptional pick. He's a uh... An intellectually honest man. He understands conditions on the ground better than most Americans, and he's passionate about seeing that Israel gets a fair shake. Lack of diplomatic experience, says Brafman, is a plus. I think maybe he brings a refreshing uh, approach to diplomacy. But Friedman's views and rhetoric have divided the Jewish community, even on home turf. I have no respect for somebody who would call uh, people with whom he disagrees uh, the equivalent of concentration camp guards. For a gentleman who wants to be America's diplomat uh, to Israel, he's going to have to learn some diplomacy. I feel that he's closed-minded, and I feel that he's... Uh you know, m more interested in being aggressive and attacking than he is in being a listener. The inflammatory rhetoric that accompanied the presidential campaign is entirely over. Supporters welcome today's apologies. He apologized. He didn't get around it in any way. He said he messed up. If approved in committee, Friedman's nomination will likely go to a final vote on the Senate floor after the break next week. On Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News.